Okay, so some people have been asking about the isotopes and the half-life question from our project. Um, I've just changed the question, so I'm using different values. Um, and here we've got an isotope as a half-life of two days uh, instead of the one we've got. And it starts off with 64 grams, which means after two days, half of it would have dissolved, uh, disintegrated. So that would be 32. After another two days, another half is disintegrated, so we're down to 16. So over here, I've drawn up my table. Uh, keep it simple. This is where I've got my graph. So all we're doing is 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. So this is all each of the two days, so where something's going on, in a sense. I have to forgive my writing here. Starts off and it's got 64 grams. After two days, half of it has disintegrated, so I'm down to 32. Another two days, we've lost half of it again. Another two days, again, half again, and so on and so on. Okay, now let's fix that up. So here's, here, this is what we expect. So I can calculate exactly that after 10 days, I should only have two grams of our radioisotope left. Now, I now want to plot this. So down here I've got time elapsed in days, so at zero, uh, zero days it's 64 grams. After two days, I'm um, 32, four days is 16. So I'm just reading these straight off the graph. Six is eight, eight is four, and 10 is two. All right, I'll just cross. And now I want to draw a line down here. And I'll just use my computer to draw it. So I've got my graph of isotope decay over time. Now, because it's, a, it's continuous, because I can go after a couple of hours or one day or seven days, so we get a continuous line. And another question that normally follows on from this is, you might say, how much would you have after three days? So we draw our line up, look at the graph and go across, and I would expect to have, it looks like approximately 22, 20, roughly 22 grams. The other op the alternative question is what happens it might say I have 35 grams how long has elapsed so if I draw my graph across from 35 and down it looks like it's 1.6 days and you can convert that into hours or whatever so hopefully that makes sense uh, I'm going to if you've got any more questions come and see me otherwise good luck